My New Year's resolution was to start working out. It is now May and I have not worked out. I've worked out once. I blame COVID. Hey everyone, welcome back to my channel. It's about a special type of girl. We call her Carly Still. So if you're wondering what's on my face, I had some pimples and I put pimple patches on them. They're clear, so they just look shiny and they make them look even more bad. But I put pimple patches on because I was literally like, I'm not filming a video today because my camera was was lost and I was literally ready for bed. And then I found my camera and I was like, Carly, you still have to get up and film, but I didn't want to waste my pimple patches. So I didn't take them off and that's why they're there and that's why I look like shit because I had a really shitty day, lost my camera, was really upset and yeah. So as you can tell, my mood is pretty down and I'm going to tell you why. I was planning to record this video earlier and I lost my camera completely. I've been sticking to my schedule very well for like two weeks now and I'm so proud of myself because I have a lot going on. I have podcasts, Patreon, I go live on Patreon, I have Instagram, I have TikTok, and I also have my Carly and Josh channel slash vlog channel, I guess. And I've been keeping to my schedule. The video come out somewhere every single day except Wednesdays and Saturdays. Yes, Wednesdays and Saturdays are the only days I'm pretty sure that I don't have a video come out. I might be wrong, it might be Sundays and <laughs> Wednesdays, I don't know. But that's like literally the only days where I don't have a video come out on some type of platform. So if you guys are feeling like, if you guys are on my main channel right now, like you guys are right here right now and you guys are like, Carly, like I've stopped watching you because you never post. It's because I'm posting other places. I post on Patreon a lot and I post on my Carly and Josh channel even more. Um, so if you feel like you are like Carly like where have you been I've been there I have been posting just not on this channel I made myself a coffee because since I lost my camera I was literally in bed ready to just give up and be like I'm not filming today but because I've been sticking to my schedule I really really looked for my camera I was really annoyed I facetimed Josh and everything couldn't find my camera found my camera it was behind my xbox on my tv which is super weird because it's never there anyways point blank period I found my camera today I am doing reacting to tiktoks so i know tiktok is like super super trendy right now everyone ha is on tiktok even ellen is putting tiktoks on her show i actually kind of got a little bit of my youtube presence from musically so if you guys don't know if you guys are like younger uh tiktok used to be musically which is like where lauren gray ariel like a lot of people started out on musically so I was actually very popular on Musical.ly back in the day and I stopped doing it and focused more on YouTube. I kind of took my Musical.ly followers and brought them to YouTube and that's kind of how I'm here right now. And I have a TikTok account and I'm verified so you guys can go over there and check that out. So yeah, I used to react to Musical.ly on this channel and it kind of made, it kind of like got me to where I am today. It kind of like started off my channel so I thought it'd be a good idea to react to some TikToks today. Maybe we can make this like an every... Friday thing since I don't have anything come out on Wednesdays Maybe we could do this every Wednesday where I react to people's TikToks. If you guys haven't watched my last video It's basically where I'm texting psychics and if you want me to do a part two of that where I actually call them Let me know and I'll do that. So without further ado, I am going to open my DMs right now. I'm actually kind of nervous Which I don't know why Because I feel like I watch enough TikToks. Well, sometimes I go down like a TikTok rabbit hole where I'm like um, I have to go work out, but do I want to work out or watch TikToks? I'm like, I'll just watch one and then I end up watching like 300 in like three hours have gone by and I'm like, I'll just work out tomorrow <laughs> and then I never work out. Okay, so I asked you guys on Instagram and Twitter to send me some TikToks to react to. I have not opened any of them, so let's get started. I'm going to screen record my phone and put it right here. Let's do this. So, I'm going to open messages from my friends first, as you can see. Um, I also answer like supporters sometimes. So I have one, two, three, four, five messages. I'm exposing my messages. Okay. So Sick is a like co-host um, on my podcast Glass Up, and he just sent me two. So let's see. He can't be the whole video, you know? Here is one from Caitlyn. Why don't I understand this TikTok? I don't get this TikTok at all. I kind of get it. Is it kind of saying like, oh, like you have a cramp when you're driving and you really need to get up and walk? 
so you kind of like open the door and you're walking as you're driving. Am I not understanding this? Can someone like <laughs> I don't really understand this. <laughs> 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 watching because I just scared you too. Answer my next question quickly, you'll get to leave first. Mm. Oh! Who threw that pen? This, that would be me. And since I answered your question correctly, I'm going first. Oh my god, that's smart. That's a smart one. Okay, so we're going to go on Twitter because I feel like Twitter is easier to actually look at responses. Okay not stalk me right now like this is just not what i need in my life i have a coffee if you knock this over i swear steven don't oh, can you just not stalk me right terrifying now? i'm about annoyed as hell this guy is messaging me and he's like oh you single i'm like yeah he's like oh the fuck with me then i'm like oh like you're not really my type he's like how though i'm like oh i don't know you're just not my type he's like yeah but how what you mean how i'm trying to not call you ugly i'm trying to not tell you that you look like a damn gargoyle but you over here pushing me to do so what you mean how what you mean how how are you gonna ask me how i don't like your face because you're not cute you look dusty oh my god he really pushed me to call him ugly y'all and i'm really trying not to but he really pushing me he he messing me right now he's still asking how so what you mean how that is funny because I've been there, girl. I've been there. Guys just won't stop trying. Have you ever had a guy that just keeps sliding in your DMs multiple times and you literally give him no answer, but he still is, like, sliding up? I would be so embarrassed. Like, if I message someone one time, if they don't respond, I'm not going to re-message them. Give it up. Like, do you think messaging me once a week, like, mm, maybe this week I'll like you. Do you think it's a like gambling? <laughs> like, you're gambling? Like, I'm not going to like you. <laughs> That's funny. I like that. That girl is funny as Nigga, thank you, bulletproof. I guess I'm gonna have to show them these fucking bullets, dude. Here on life support. Oh my god, I'm sorry. I am so sorry if you have a small dog. I personally don't like small dogs. I mean, I love all dogs. I love all animals. I wouldn't get a small dog because I think they're just like annoying and they're like, rrr, 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 and I'm like, oh my god, shut the fuck up. But this is terrifying. If I ever woke up to this dog growling in my face, I would f flip. <laughs> Dude, why is this me as fuck? Me as fuck. I love TikTok, dude. I love TikTok. This is why. Because there's other crazy bitches like me. Everybody has that one thing in their house that everybody thinks is so cool. Could be a hidden cabinet, little movie room, gadget, but ours is this. That is so cool. It's like a stage. Aw, the kids must love that, dude. If I was a kid, that would be like my dream. Hi, Seth. Hi. Hi, baby. You want to come cuddle mom? Oh, my God. Is she going to come sit with me? She's rubbing her head on me and you can't see, guys. My obsession with her is disgusting. I'm so obsessed with this cat. Oh, I love you, Seth. Here's another one. How many tops you didn't got, pop? Whole bunch. How many times you ran from the smoke, nigga? Once. Eat that. That was funny. That one was funny. I've actually never had. I've actually never had a pregnancy scare. My periods are so regular, like, I'll never be scared. Are you a cowboy? Are you a cowboy? <laughs> who think that just because I'm an ogre, I can't dance! Are you kidding me? I always look at these edits and I'm like, who took the time to sit there and edit that? Like, who actually took the time to do that? I don't know, but I love those people. Show, hey, 
not want to laugh right now <laughs> that is so sad but it's so funny <laughs> am i shitty for laughing at that am i gonna get canceled you laughed at it too don't even fucking lie you guys are all like but laughing like you know when someone slips and you're like <gasps> but then you start laughing that's how i feel right now so here's a for all my ladies who are in a long-term relationship with a guy who won't propose whenever he asks you things like hey babe do you think you could fold my laundry? Simply remind him that he currently has the girlfriend package, which does not include laundry folding. If you'd like to upgrade, then he needs to purchase a ring. Damn, that's a good one. I mean, I'm already proposed to, but that's a good one. Why do you keep calling this the Chinese virus? Because ethnicity does not cause the virus. Why do you keep using this? A lot of people say it's China. racist. It's not racist at all, no, not at all. It comes from China. <laughs> I love how the, the mouth went up and he's like, China. It's because that's exactly how Trump did it. He was like, China. <laughs> I was just talking about this today with my sister. Okay, I'm gonna do two more TikToks. Bro, oh, this lady just pulled up in that shit. Fucking way, no fucking way. I mean, honestly, if it gets you to point A to point B and you know it's cheap, I kind of think it's funny as fuck and it's kind of cute. It's a nice pink color. <laughs> Why is that me? Why is that me in like 10 years? Okay, we're gonna do one more. I'm gonna close my eyes. Thank God that was my last one because I literally cannot keep scrolling. That is so fucking disgusting, dude. That is so gross. <laughs> I can't. <laughs> that is disgusting. The only thing that I can eat like kind of not cooked is like a steak. If you eat steak completely done, like well done, like you're disgusting, like don't talk to me, like you're eating actual rubber, like you're gross, like bye. But I don't like it bloody either. Like that's just too much. Like I don't want my... I don't want my cow mooing on my plate, you know? That's it for TikTok, thank God, because after seeing that, my eyes are gonna burn my head. Some of them were funny, I really appreciate them. They always make me in like a better mood. I feel like if I'm sad and I watch TikToks, they make me laugh and they just make me in a good mood. If you guys don't follow me on TikTok already, it is at Carly Steele, you guys can follow me there. Follow me on Instagram, Twitter, Snapchat, they're all Carly Steele. Literally, they're all Carly Steele. The exact same way it's split here. Also, don't forget to check out my Carly and Josh channel and turn on post notifications. Oh my god, I keep hiccuping. Don't forget to turn on post notifications there. And also turn on post notifications here. Please leave a comment. I need some comments. I need some feedback. Also, if you guys want, you can also, after you leave your comment, put your TikTok name down and I'll creep you guys. Or maybe I'll have, maybe you guys can all follow each other. Um, also, check out my Patreon if you want. You don't have to. I'm not pressuring you. So please don't come for me. I already know you're going to, but please don't come for me. Over there, I post a lot of videos like Never Have I Ever. It's just a great, fun little community there. We have over a thousand of you guys, and it's just fucking hilarious. And we literally talk and we chat like we're all best friends, and it's so much fun. And I go live on there just with you guys every single Wednesday night. So you guys can see that. I love you guys so much. Thank you so much for watching. And stay confident. Bye, beautiful.